like even though it's being paid by a credit, it still watches really closely mm -hmm. because that's that's an extra whatever a thousand or two thousand dollars in her mind um, that she can't use towards something else. Well, let even me see. She's not paying for it now. Right. It's it's a reduction in what she has available. Oh, okay. I see what you're saying. All right. So mm -hmm. let me think here. Um, open this up here. And you said the 59, she wants to know from 52 to 59, which one went where? Okay. This one, or is this the same one? No. I want to make sure I got the right one going from the 52. To 59. There was another one for 52? Yeah, there's uh, you know, it's the E and O one that you're working on, right? Okay. Is it that one? Oh, okay. So I thought that these were two different things. So they, this is where, this is where it's so damn confusing. So initially, yes, they were the same, same work, all being done together. One statement of work for $5,238 should be fine. She just blew that up today and said, forget the e &O, just give me the statement of work to get the transaction report done. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can she, explain. She blew that up. And, and again, you can see it from her perspective, two reports for 5230, and now we're giving her one for 5900. Okay, I can explain. Getting, Easy. Yeah. Okay, here's the story. 15 hours reporting, you're going to get the project manager. We gave her a blended rate. Right there, 5,900. This other one here, I did it. I did not give a blended rate. Right. She got her hour, the new pet said, in this case, he has said um, 10 hours, five hours for the project manager, and I had a, B, and a BA time and a, it, um, an MD time. So and, and this makes sense. She did not get a blended rate and it wasn't, done in the same way. The reporting was put at 10 hours, plus we had a BA in there, plus the MD in there. And the blended rate of her 295 is different than this. That's why there was a price difference. And technically speaking, if we were gonna see, consider this just reporting, yes, we're trying to do it as a blended rate. If that is a discretion of, you know, like the MDs, we're trying to, you know, in other words, um, one thing with a blended rate, if, Jonathan Washburn used two hours or three hours, this blended rate would give the BI a couple of more hours and still be within budget. Because that was, a, I just happened to be asking Lisa yesterday about these going for two, 2022, how did we really want to handle reporting? Did we want to do reporting at the blended rate? Because that would make it easier because technically maybe just a new and a project manager and versus something else like what I have here and but it's just a matter of choice and i, I just said uh, okay at this point we'll just do it this way if if a noob needs to use more time more budget money they'll have some of the ba time they'll have some of the time in here because usually the projects you know the mds are not building against the projects but mm -hmm. uh, apparently the company is looking for profitability on all projects so they're, they're really pushing it this year as to are we being profitable on our project as a company and yeah, so yeah, yeah. you know so this is what the story is. She got a blended rate and she got, <clears throat> um, this was done a different way where she's got a reporting hours here was at 10, 10 hours. That's why this was, and she probably sees that too. 52, easy. That would be why too, less hours. So, so, there's, so there's the 5230. Mm -hmm. That's the price that was quoted for both pieces of work. So what we've done, is we basically kept 